I'm going to let y'all know that this is probably one of the last vlogs for a little bit. Hear me out. Are you ready? It's a new day. What's up, everybody? It's a new, new day. Today is a new day. Today is a new day. A new, new day. Nah, I'm not gonna snap my Some neck. Action! That gotta be it. Right there. So we here at Kennesaw Mountain. It's like the biggest mountain in the city. Um, I'm about to challenge myself. I've been ducking this mountain for some time now, y'all. You know when you just ducking something that you know, you know. You should do. It's another challenge, y'all. What I tell you, I'll be telling y'all about challenging myself. Um, I feel like that's the way I get better in life. I just progress forward. I continuously challenge myself. So that's what we're going to do today. I'm going to try to get the drone up in the air when I get to the top. Get some dope drone shots so y'all can enjoy that for sure. And uh, maybe speaking on some sad slash good news. So pay attention all the way. Do this vlog. You don't want to miss nothing. Don't forget to like, subscribe, comment below. Check out the merch in the description. It's that hustle mentality we're talking about. I gotta pay for parking out here. Gotta pay for parking. Got a little history lesson we got going on. The rifle pits. Uh, got a lot to go, y'all. Got a lot to go. People look tired already. I'm just bumping. I got the headphones. Why do you think people don't challenge themselves more? I've been thinking about that. Why do we sev settle for comfort? Why are we losing our, our drive to hunt? Our drive to, to go get it? It don't make no sense. I mean, people in my culture really don't. Because a lot of our parents, they risked it all just to be here. And a lot of us are just comfortable. Not everybody. If you're watching this, you're probably not comfortable I'm trying to get after it. So keep going. I applaud you. I'm tired as hell. I don't think I was ready for this. Now I'm about nature, y'all. Oh, I'm a little tired. I think we got a half a mile back. What's more important for y'all in life? Is it offense or is it defense? Let me know in the comments. Offense, defense. Take it how you take it. Answer it how you intake it. Don't say it depends. Give me an answer in the comments. Offense or defense. And if you got extra time, share why. Oh, hell no. Oh, hell no. Oh, hell no. Oh, damn. This was like a moment where like, I don't want to be on my phone. I want to just embrace the nature. I am recording myself, but I don't really consider that uh, using technology. I just, I'm listening to music, enjoying, uh, enjoying the scenery. I should do this more often. Hmm. I'll see what's going on. I'm not even exaggerating. Look at that. Look at that. So this. Hey, let us see. No sequence. But the solution. Okay, this is where the cannons was at. So they bring the ratchets out. This is this is a this is a ratchet. Imagine shooting this big ass thing. If you miss, you fuck. You ain't got no hope. Unless you can pack this bad boy pretty fast. 
But what is you hitting out there? I don't know. I don't know. I'm glad I didn't grow up in that age. Imagine you getting hit one of them big old boulders. Crazy. Let's get it. We're going all the way to the top. I think we already did a mile. I think I made it to the top. I'm going across now because I'm going down. If I'm going down, I'm going down towards my vehicle. I'm not trying to go down on the other side. I've been walking too long already. Oh, there goes that phone. Gotta, I gotta tend to it. And no phones on this walk. I'm not gonna lie though, look at these views. to be like a good rest spot. That's where everybody's resting at right now. It's like halfway. Just came from all the way up there. All I can think about right now is some quesadillas I got waiting at home for me. That's literally all I can think about right now. Um, But I'm going to let y'all know that this is probably one of the last vlogs for a little bit. Hear me out. Hear me out. Um. I'm going into creative mode, so I won't be able to do as many as often as I'd like, um, but I'll be recording as much as I can so that I can just still be giving y'all the journey. I'm going to be working on uh, a few things, pod slash show, and um, yeah, so that's where my focus is going to be at. I'm going to be doing the lives for Shiny Ants and then working on that. And then I'll be recording everything like behind the scenes so y'all won't miss anything for sure. But I'm just gonna be tied up and I think it's needed. I'm gonna be focusing on some merch too so so that y'all can support, we can get bigger and bigger and bigger. That's the goal. I know going down is gonna suck right now. Like it's all hilly, like my, my feet are sliding to the front of my shoe. God protect me. God protect me. Son. Hot. Back to the beat. Now that's how you let the beat build. Now that's how you let the beat build. Beat go on. Uh -uh, uh -uh. It go boom. Ba boom boom. The beat go boom. Ba boom ba boom. Boom. Y'all know that song. It's so hot out. Woof. Woof. What was I saying? Oh, Lord. Let me tell you something. Yeah, you know what I realized? Society has pushed us to work against each other, which is wild. Like, we fail to realize is that everybody can't be the boss. There has to be workers. There's an ecosystem. Like, that's how it works. And I feel like we're in a, we're in a part of society right now where everybody and I... I love the enthusiasm, but everybody doesn't have the mentality, doesn't have the fight, doesn't have the critical thinking to be the leader. Um, some people have to, I don't want to say take orders, but follow the leader. 
follow the leader because the leader is moving in the best interest of everybody. And, you know, the real leaders are very easy to spot out. It's the ones that aren't really leaders that act as leaders. Um, those are the ones that, like, that make everything more difficult. So we all can't be leaders. And you got to know what role you play. And that's not saying that you don't have, you shouldn't have any aspirations to lead or to be your own boss. I'm not saying that. Um, but understand that if you don't have the qualities of a leader, you have to develop that. And that may take time. And that may, that may mean you have to a shadow a leader. Um, work with them. Help them build their platform. Help them build their brand. Learn everything. Um, actually, usually it's easier that way for, for someone if you're patient enough because if you're working under someone else's brand, kind of shadowing them, they're spending the money, not you. You're just spending time. So if you find a formula that works, it benefits you when you go to spend your money because you won't spend as much because you'll know what to skip, what works, and what doesn't. You feel me? It depends on how you... Like, life is all about perspective. So... We can't all be bosses. We can't all be Shaddai. Right? It's all right. I, I know. I know. I, you know, the line's out the door for everybody want to be Shaddai, but we all can't be me. So find your role. Whatever it is, whether it's the leader, second to leader, the muscle, whatever your role is, find it out and play that 100%. And if you feel like you conquered that role, try to take another role and try to conquer that. But don't just go straight to the lead and try to take on all these roles that you have no clue on how to go about it. You got to want to get the information, y'all. Yeah, we to the crib, though. I don't know. That's just what I wanted to say. Because I feel like people be thinking they can lead. They're thinking they can, you know, oh, why? Man, you ain't a leader. I've messed up. I, I've made mistakes as a leader. And I feel like I have a lot of great leadership qualities, but I've made mistakes as a leader. And I've corrected them. And I'm gonna continue to lead. I'm gonna continue to lead this boat. Are you with me? Are you getting on or are you getting off? Are you staying on or are you getting off? Figure it out, y'all.